The first senior we would like to thank is Jack Chapman. He is joined by Don and Lisa Chapman. His grade point is a 3.5. His favorite teachers were Susie Gerard and Eric Woodard. His other activities in school were golf, biking, hanging out with friends and watching movies. He was on the honor roll three times and he was an honorable mention football in uh, 2013. His future plans? plans to attend college and attain some sort of business degree. And here's his statement. Thank you to my parents who have supported me in three sports my whole high school career. My coaches who have brought nothing but support and guidance. I'd also like to thank my teammates, present and past, for making my LC experience so special. It's been an experience I will not soon forget. Lastly, I'd like to thank the Lewis and Clark community, especially my teachers who helped me to be successful. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Jack Chapman. The next senior is Austin Halini. He is joined by his dad, Phil, and his mom, Mary. His grade point is a 3.974. So close. His favorite subject was economics with Mr. Thu. His other activities in school, while not playing basketball, I like to play golf, he liked to bowl, I like to hang out with friends. He enjoys making videos with his friends for YouTube. His favorite LCH memory was dunking in the game his sophomore year. For future plans, next year he plans to attend Eastern and study accounting to become a CPA. And here's his statement. I want to thank all my coaches for putting in the time and effort that goes into coaching us. I also want to thank all my teammates for making basketball fun and funny every year. Lastly, I want to thank my parents for supporting me all these years and always being there for me. And thanks to my mom for recording all my games. I know I will enjoy watching them someday. Ladies and gentlemen, Austin Hoey. Our next senior is Corey Keepers. Joined by his mom Jen, his stepdad Russ, his dad Mike, stepmom Tina, and his sister Jordan. Great point, 2.8. His favorite class, Apes with Mrs. Rambo. His other activities in school were football, baseball, recreational golf, bowling, hanging out with friends, lifting, and eating large amounts of food and watching sports. Uh, his honor is here, first team all GSL football this year. His favorite LC memory and moment is being a part of all the great sports teams and shedding all the blood, sweat, and tears on the playing field. His future plans, he, hopes, he wants to play college football, earn a degree in business, and begin to take on the world. This is his statement. Thank you to my family, you guys are my number one supporters and have always kept me on the right track. Thank you to Coach Norton for giving me an opportunity to play this year. You're the type of coach who truly cares about his players and expects the best out of us in everything we do. To my teammates, you guys have been a highlight of my final year. Who knew going to a gym and doing drills until you can't breathe anymore could be so great with a dozen other guys? To the LC community, thank you for giving me a place to grow as an individual, competing in athletics, and giving me a place to go to school. Ladies and gentlemen, Corey Keefer. The next senior we would like to honor is Brennan Schoen. He is joined by his mom and dad. His grade point is a 3.4. His favorite subject in school is math. His other activities were football and track. He was first team all GSL in football and track. His favorite LCH memory is the times he spent on the field, court, or track. For his future plans, he says he wants to play football or run track in college. This is his statement. Thank you, Coach Norton, and the rest of the basketball staff for all four years. Thank you, Mom and Dad, for supporting me in everything I do. I can never thank you guys enough. And I want to thank you guys for all the memories that I can cherish for a lifetime. Ladies and gentlemen, Brady Schoen. Yeah. 
Next thing you would like to honor is Connor Smith. Please join by Stacy Sean and Ian Smith. His grade point is a 3.5, his favorite class was science. For his future plans, he says, I plan on attending a four year college and obtaining a pharmaceutical degree. This is his statement. Dad, Mom, and Ian, I can't thank you enough for the opportunities you've given me in my first 18 years of life. I'm so blessed by the unconditional love I receive from all of you every single day. Words can't describe how appreciative I am for all the things you've sacrificed for me over the years. I'm truly grateful to have you as my family. Ladies and gentlemen, Connor Smith. And the last thing you would like to honor is Dean Ritchie. He's joined by his mom, grandma, the Stouffer family, and the David family. His grade point is a 3.0. His favorite teachers were Mr. Kohler, Coach Hanson, and Coach Yura. He says, nobody in my life has shown the amount of affection, love, or kindness that my grandma has, even through the hard times. You stuck by my side. Nobody has a place in my heart like you do. To my mother, I love you. I literally wouldn't be here without you. Through the ups and downs, I never stopped loving you. I think it's important you know that. For a single 16-year-old parent living on her own, you did a better job than anyone else on earth could have. You truly amaze me. I always have battled diversity and come out on top. I gladly say I inherited that trait. Thank you, Mom and Nana. I love you. His favorite LCH memory, he says, I would have to say freshman year practicing at Libby every day with Coach Yera it was pretty awesome. My favorite moment would be if Coach Yera or Coach Goller got back at it again, though. Uh, he'd like to express his gratitude to teammates. He says, shout out to Connor and Brennan. It's crazy we've been at it together for so long. Since elementary school, seniors, let's win this dang game, get in the playoffs, and beat me, Ferris, or whoever. I'll try to stop Brett from having 40. To the young ones, especially Nick and Malik, after this season, the team is in your hands. Be leaders, do right, and take care of it. Love all of you guys. He says, the investment in the LC community, especially the Damons and the Stokers have made into me, has got me to the position where I am today. Truly, my gratitude cannot be expressed through words. Such an act of kindness by these families has inspired me to give back, to help not just an individual, but a whole community, or maybe even the city. I hope that through my acts in life, you see my gratitude and just know everything I do would be impossible without you. Thank you. And lastly, but not least, I'd like to thank my pastors, Pastor Darnell and Pastor Shaw. I would like to conclude by saying, God is real. Just look at my life. Ladies and gentlemen, Dean Ritchie. Let's give a big round.